Good afternoon, I'm Mark Rodehaver. I'm an associate here at Berkshire Hathaway Utah Properties, and today it's the middle of September 2020, and we're standing here in Lower Deer Valley. And what people generally ask me about Lower Deer Valley and what the attraction is, really is the mature landscaping. As you drive around Lower Deer Valley and you compare it to Old Town and maybe even down into the canyons, you'll find Lower Deer Valley is about three to four degrees cooler than when you get down into the Snyderville Basin. Up here it's a little bit cooler and you have mature landscaping as you'll see around some of these condominium complexes. And over my shoulder here is the Deer Valley Plaza. One thing in there is the Deer Valley Cafe, one of my favorite places to eat in town. Um, if you like the normal Deer Valley food like the Deer Valley chili and the cookies and the sandwiches, um, you can actually have that here over my shoulder right there, eat outside. One of the greatest places in Deer Valley to really eat outside here on the lake. Um, watch the activities, the paddleboard, the kids swimming, um, the kids fishing. Um, also next to that inside, you'll see the Deer Valley Lodge. That's where their offices are. So to the extent you're checking in during your stay, you will go in here at the Deer Valley Plaza at the Deer Valley Lodgings desk there. So to your right and to my left, this is a community called Lakeside. Um, these are two and three bedrooms. Mostly there are a few four bedroom options. They're gonna range, you're gonna start somewhere around the 800 range and go to three bedrooms will be in the low millions, million two, million three. The nice thing about Lower Deer Valley is we're now across the street from the Deer Valley um, Cafe and Lakeside and just over my shoulder here is your pickup. That can take you with the free shuttle bus up to Snow Park Lodge for either skiing or the summer activities or it will take you down to Main Street, Old Town Park City. Um, it's also about a mile walk, whichever one you want to do, but you can be picked up and dropped off right here about every 20 minutes. Okay, so now we're about a mile from where we were at the Deer Valley Cafe. We're standing in Solomir. So this is the Solomir Tennis Club. There is a tennis club here and a pool. It is um, built into the HOA if you live here in Solomir. If you head north from Solomir, you go into the Oaks over the hill, and then you have Morningstar Estates over here to the right. So what you'll find in Solomir is you will have the mature landscaping as we talked about earlier. Um, you are going to find larger, uh, many homes that are updated here, very close access to Old Town. So over the shoulder here is where we just left from. That would be the Solomir that brings you into Solomir and then you go up into the Oaks. Um, you'll also see uh, Pinnacle, which is another condominium complex here, and a few that we've talked about. As we walk to the south, we're going to go to the Snow Park Lodge right now and do a walk around there as well. Okay, now we're at the Snow Park Lodge. I generally call this the main lodge of Park City um, because here's where you will go in for if you're taking your kids to ski school. They, they check in through these doors here and you start your ski experience on Wide West, which is a run just around to the left. Ticket sales are here. Um, if you're getting your ski pass, on the other hand, you're gonna go around this building and then upstairs. So every year here in Deer Valley, they host the Freestyle World Cup. And over my shoulder here, this run that's right down the middle, that's where the mogul competition is. And then to the right, you'll see kind of that hump. That's where the aerials are. The Freestyle World Cup is annual. It is in February, generally. I mean, it is cold, so be prepared. You're gonna walk from here up there. You do not take a lift. It's a great local experience here in Deer Valley. Let's go over here and we'll talk about some of the lifts. Okay, so there's two lifts here also that will take you farther up the mountain here at Snow Park Lodge. The first lift is Carpenter that's gonna take you more or less to the top center of the mountain where you can ski back on the front side. And then Silver Lake Express will take you over to Silver Lake Village. You can actually get off there and then go ski. You'll have to get on another lift, but you'll go ski over at Bald Mountain. Okay, so now we're standing on the Vents Lawn here on the back side of the Snow Park Lodge. Right here is where they normally have the summer concert series. Um, it is free and open to the public on Wednesday nights. The nice thing is, is you can bring a blanket and a bottle of wine and enjoy the music. Um, Fridays and Saturdays are generally um, larger names which you'll pay for. Um, these condos here, that is Black uh, Diamond Lodge. Um, it's nice because it is ski in, ski out. And then this lift here is Burns, which this first run here is called Wide West. And that's where the kids start their day when they learn to ski. Okay, another nice thing about Lower Deer Valley and this area around the Snow Park Lodge is you'll see the trails right here. Great biking, great hiking. From this area, you can get on multiple trails. Also, the Mid-Mountain Trail starts right up there. Take that for 26 miles all the way over to Canyons Village. The another nice feature about Deer Valley and here at the Snow Park Lodge is free ski storage and pole storage. Come down here at the end of the day, check it, and they'll give you a tag. You can get it again in the morning. 
Um, you can leave them here for a couple of days. And I wouldn't leave them here all season, but you definitely can leave them here short term at no charge. Again, my name is Mark Rodehaber. We're here at Lower Deer Valley. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and also find me on Instagram at Mr.ParkCity. Have a good day.